Alexander Wayne, Alex. wrist 80K, 80. drive top McLean, park it at the flame. Think I What's up everyone's Blue Nova and I'm bringing you a tutorial on Quavo and Lil Yachty's song called Ice Tray. I'm going to go ahead and jump straight into it. I'm going to make this tutorial very short and smooth as possible. So I'm going to turn off everything on the master. Um, the first thing, I guess to give it a little breakdown, uh, I know people really want to get that Migos uh, clear quality because their voice is really low, but then it's also very crisp in the high end. So we're going to go ahead and get that same quality. So I'm going to go ahead and mute the instrumental and then mute the background vocals. So um, this is exactly the size, I guess, I guess this is the size of the vocal that I recorded uh, for anybody who really wants to know. So the first thing we have is the Autotune VST. And you want to have your retune speed set to 10, your key set that to C, your scale minor. I put the input type on soprano voice. You want to go ahead and freeze the screen and get all these other settings, but I'm going to go ahead and play this part. Alexander Wayne, wrist Eddie Kane, drop top McLean, park it at the flame. So after we have that, the next thing is going to be fruity limiter. What I went ahead and did is I brought the release all the way down to zero. And then you want to bring the gain all the way up till it hits uh, the zero ceiling. So basically, just going to level out the whole entire vocal. And this is what it's going to sound like and look like. Alexander Wayne, wrist Eddie Kane, drop top McLean, park it at the flame. After that, you want to have a parametric EQ too. Now, like I said, Migos vocals, they're really crisp. It actually took a while to really know how to get the high end frequency. But really, uh, to do that, you wanna you don't want to dip out too much of the low frequency, but you want to increase the high frequency all the way up. Uh, you'll notice in this song, once you compare this vocal to the original song, uh, which I will include my vocals within the folder, uh, you'll know exactly what I'm talking about. So just playing this part. Alexander Wayne, wrist Eddie Kane, drop top McLean, park it at the flame. Now you can see the coloration looks pretty much even, like the high end is really up there. So, so we're gonna, <clears throat> sorry, so we're gonna take care of that really soon. So um, after that, like I said, their vocals have a lot of high end presence. So you even wanna get a little bit more. I was really trying to achieve the same quality as uh, Quavo in this part. And I was just playing it back to back to make sure I got it and I got something very, very, very similar. Uh, so we'll play this. Alexander Wayne, wrist Eddie Kane, drop top McLean, park it at the flame. After that, you want to have the SS Stereo, uh, which is a waste plugin. If you don't have waste plugin, then you can use uh, go to Maximus, then select the preset split band, uh, de -esser, and then it'll de -esser your vocals. And then you might want to adjust the band if you do that method. But for now, we're going to be using the de -esser Stereo by Waves. So I brought the threshold down by negative 18. The frequency 5506, sidechain, select high pass, and then you want to have a monitor, uh, the monitor on audio, and then we'll go ahead and play it. Alexander Wayne, wrist Eddie Kane, drop top McLean, park it at the flame. So after that, uh, we want to go ahead and have a uh, delay. It's really not needed in this vocal. Um, when I was comparing it back to Quavo's verse, there wasn't much delay, but I went ahead and added it just to give it, I guess, like a little bit more spice into the vocal. So you want to go ahead and um, just make sure that your volume is a little bit down, I guess, around this area. Uh, sometimes I usually bring the cut back, but I just left it as is for now. And then the time, have it straight down the middle. So we'll go ahead and play it. Alexander Wayne, wrist Eddie Kane, drop top McLean, park it at the flame. The next thing we have is reverb, an effect that Migos love to use. Um, I went ahead and just brought the high cut up. Uh, go ahead and put the uh, low cut frequency right here. You want to just have it straight down in the middle. And then you just really want to freeze the screen and get these settings. And if you don't, if you want the exact thing, go to BlueNovaBeast.com. Uh, this folder with all the uh, mixer insert tracks, you can go ahead and drag it and put on any so you can get that once you go to store and click on vocal chains. But we'll go ahead and play this. Alexander Wayne, wrist Eddie Kane, drop top McLean, park it at the flame. After that, we have a fruity limiter. You want to go ahead and bring your release down all the way to zero and just make sure that your vocal is just sitting uh, at zero decibels. But we're going to go ahead and bring it down to negative six. That's why you see it there um, 
right here on the meter. But we'll go ahead and play what we have so far. Alexander Wayne, wrist Eddie Kane, drive top McLean, park it at the flame. After that, the very last thing is to really take care of uh, some more of the high end frequency. So what we went ahead and did is uh, I just brought the band down to negative three. That's gonna take care of that extra uh, high end frequency. And then the mid, just bring that band all the way up. Your low, just uh, leave it to about right here. It doesn't even matter. It's really not being adjusted or affected. Um, and for your master right here, just go ahead and go to the threshold and then bring it over to the left by 1%. You can see 1% in the upper left hand corner. And then we'll go ahead and play it. Alexander Wayne, wrist Eddie Kane, drive top McLean, park it at the flame. Think I was insane. So after that, the next thing is just gonna be um, the ad lib that you notice. Uh, re there's gonna be a lot of reverb, like I said, Migos love having that wide reverb sound and vocal. So that's the only thing that's really gonna be different here. And to get that wide stereo sound in effect that you hear in the ad libs, you wanna turn uh, the stereo knob to about 35, 36%. And just to freeze the screen, if you wanna get these settings or get the actual thing at bluenovabeast.com. And I'll go ahead and play it. I'll just mute the lead vocal and then you can hear the ad lib right here. Alex, Alex, Eddie, Eddie, drop top, drop top, screw. So yeah, that's really how you're gonna get that same vocal effect, uh, that same ad lib effect that you hear with Migos. And just playing it all together with the instrumental. I didn't do anything to the instrumental. I try to leave it as so. Um, so you want to go ahead and have the ozone 5 equalizer on your master and then you just want to cut the uh, high frequency you want to click the drop down on the eighth band low pass select brick wall that's going to take care of the high end frequency and it's going to clean up the mix if you don't have that uh just know i got you on the backup i got the fruity convolver right here and it's basically going to do the same exact thing um and i know it's kind of hard to get this uh, like i said bluenovabeast.com you know exactly where to get it so you can have that same exact preset that I have right here. And the last thing would be Fruity Convolver. So just taking it off, uh, this will be the backup. So, you know, if you have, when you get the FLP, you can just have this, but we're just gonna play these two right now. Alex, Riz, Eddie K, drive top McLean, park it at the flame. Think I was insane, well my jeweler brain. So yeah, that's pretty much how you'll get the same a quality uh, and vocal effect that you hear in Migo song. So if you have any questions, go ahead and email me at bluenovabeast at gmail.com or you can go to bluenovabeast.com, go to the contact form on the bottom and you can send me a message through there and I'll get it uh, straight to my email. But if you need any mixing mastering, go ahead and contact me for the same thing. Uh, I'm free to do so. And also uh, if you need any beats, go to the store. You can get any beat that you want right now. But make sure to like, like, subscribe, share, and comment what you want to see next on this video. But thank you all for watching. Well, my jeweler brain, hiding Kurt Cobain, Hunter Bruce Wayne.